the electronic welding regulator will be delivered with a power supply and shunt. For the installation you need a gas hose, two clamps, hose cutters and a screwdriver. Before the EWR can be used, it has to be mounted in an upright position, for this you can use the optional bracket holder. You can mount the bracket holder both on the welding machine and for example on a wall close by. Insert the connector from the power supply in the connection on the left side of the EWR and tighten the screw. Insert the connector from the shunt in the connection on the right side of the EWR and tighten the screw. Mount the shunt in an optional position along the positive or negative cable. Now switch on the power supply for the EWR. After that the lamps are lit. Mount the gas hose from the gas supply on the incoming connection on the EWR. Mount the gas hose from the welding machine on the outgoing gas connection on the EWR. If there are other gas regulating devices in the gas line, you have to open them completely or remove them. When the incoming gas pressure is in the right range, the red lamp on the EWR shall go out. The incoming gas pressure has to be between 2.5 and 5 bar in order to ensure a continuous function. The incoming gas pressure shall be kept constant. If the incoming gas pressure is below 2 bar, the red lamp on the EWR is lit. If the incoming gas pressure comes down below 1 bar, the EWR stops. Now the EWR is installed. But before welding starts, please pay attention to the setting and optimizing of gas flow and outgoing gas pressure. The gas flow can be set in steps by 1 liter between the limit values. One press is equal to 1 liter per minute. The orange lamp shows the factory setting, which is in this case 14 liters per minute. You can change the preset characteristic line with a plus and minus button by 1 liter up and down. To do this, you press the plus or the minus button until the correct characteristic line has been set. After 5 seconds of waiting time this value is automatically stored on the EWR. To set the outgoing gas pressure, pull the connector from power supply off, press the on-off button and hold it, at the same time insert the connector from the power supply again. Now the EWR is in gas pressure mode, factory setting is 0.6 bar gas pressure. You can adjust the settings with a plus and minus button in steps by 0.2 bar. After setting, press the on-off button once, this causes the EWR to return to the gas flow control range. After the setting is done, tighten the screw again, so that the contact cannot fall out. If porosity occurs at the beginning of the welding seam, increase the outgoing gas pressure. If porosity occurs at the welding seam while welding, increase the gas flow with the plus button until quality of the welding seam is satisfactory. If the quality is satisfactory, you have found the right setting for the gas flow.